Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about multiplying and dividing positive and negatives, and we want to find each quotient. So, if I was given this quotient, 153 divided by 17, we're in a little differently here. So, 153 divided by 17. Well, hmm, how can we solve this? Well, 17 is a prime number. I can't, I can't break that down. And so, uh... 153, I know I can break down. So we think about 153. I'm pretty sure I can break down, right? And we want to think, okay, how can I, what goes into this number? Well, I think 3 does, so I'm going to try that. Okay, that could be wrong. So 3 goes into 153. Well, right, 3 goes into 15. Well, 3 goes into 15, that's 5 times, right? 5, 3, 15 right here. 0, bring out this 3, and 3 goes into 1. Uh, 3, uh, 3 goes into 3 one time, right? And 1 times 3 is 3, subtract 0, we're good. So 51 is what I'm looking here, right? 51. So 3 goes into uh, 153 uh, 51 times, okay? Well, 51, can, is that divisible by 3? It is. So we have 3, right? So I'm going to read right here. Uh, 3 goes into 51. Well, 3 goes into 5, right? Uh, 1 time. 1 times 3 is 3. We subtracted 5 minus 3 is just 2, bring down the 1, and 3 goes into 21 7 times. 7 times 3 is 21, we subtract 0, we're good. And so 51 is 3 times 17. And now I'm kind of done breaking it down. So I'm going to rewrite this fraction to 17 in the denominator. It's easier for me to see. And it's division here, because that's really what's going on, right? 153 divided by 17, like this, right? So 17 in the denominator, the numerator, 153, is 3 times 3 times 17. Well, the 17's cancel, and now we're left with 3 times 3, which is just 9. And our final answer is 9. So again, let's recap. We start with 153 divided by 17. 153, using long division, we could break down to be 3 and 51. All right, 3 times 3 times 17, because 3 and 51 is 153, and 51 is 3 times 17. So 3 times 3 times 17 is 153, we wrote here. I rewrote the 153 divided by 17 as a fraction. Cancel out the 17s, and we're left with 3 times 3, which is just 9.